फिल्म मेकर करण जौहर लॉन्च सरोद मास्ट्रो उस्ताद अमजद अली खान बुक मास्टर ऑन मास्टर्स एट द ताज विवानता मुंबई delves into khan's personal encounters with some of the greatest icons of indian classical music moderated by suhail seth the event was also attended by khan's family singer pankaj udas and actor tanisha mukherjee among others karan johar read out excerpts from the book which extensively talked about khan sahab's personal life the chapter i will read is on begum akhtar it was a personal experience that khan sahab has shared with us in the book and i'd like to read an excerpt from there begum sahiba had great regard and admiration for my father she once told me that she tried to persuade abba sahab to record his music but he was against recordings because he had observed classical music records being played during weddings and private parties while the guests milled about talking eating and drinking whatever recordings of his are available are from his live radio broadcasts late in his life none exist of him playing at his prime begum sahib had tried to convince him on many many occasions but he stood his ground the first time i saw begum sahib perform was in calcutta she always smiled while she sang before i could say adab to her she promptly said khan sahab adab i thought she was making fun of me whenever i was in the audience she would make it a point to seek my permission before she sang the, in the concert saying khan sahab ijazat hai khan sahab may i begin i used to feel quite embarrassed by this until i realized that through me she was honoring and paying her respects to my forefathers she maintained this warmth and love from the stage on every occasion sometime in 1970 or 71 a few years before she passed away air in kashmir invited both of us to perform at hari bhavan we stayed at the beautiful obroy hotel now hotel lalit governor bhagwan sahai was the chief guest it was a packed hall being much younger than her i requested begum sahiba to allow me to begin the evening to allow me to begin the evening on hearing this she touched both her ears and said ye gustahi main nahi kar sakti hu i cannot do this i was really worried about performing after her but she was adamant our exchange went on for some time when the air officials came to invite us i tried to rush to the stage but begum sahiba caught my hand and ran on to the stage herself and i was left behind in the wings watching her when the curtain was opened she sat down and began her concert with a smile shakur khan and ramzan khan were on the sarangi and tabla respectively backstage i was listening to her ethereal songs and praying to god almighty to bless my concert too she sang four ghazals and every song was so appealing that it left the audience enthralled during the intermission before my performance governor sahai came backstage to meet the artists when it was my turn to perform to my utter surprise i saw begum sahiba sitting in the audience to give respect and to honor her gracious and magnanimous gesture i kept my sarod aside and said that after her singing i had forgotten all ragas and raginis i requested her to return to her hotel and rest she said lijiye ki hum aapko sun nahi sakte bismillah kariye aap can i not listen to you please begin this was one of my most cherished memories of begum akhtar this truly seems like a special book a book for all music lovers a book for everyone searching for soul and a book that doesn't only travel and transcend but also connects so deeply thank you again for giving me this opportunity dekhiye main 10 saal tak week magazine mein column likhta tha har mahine aur wo bhi ek kitab uski bhi karwai chal rahi hai 
और फिर लोग कह रहे हैं कि ऑटोबायोग्राफी भी लिखना चाहिए अब उसका भी वक्त आ गया है तो शायद वो भी मैं शुरू करूँगा और बाकी तो अभी बहुत कुछ है समझने के लिए हमारी अपनी दुनिया में संगीत में बहुत कुछ समझना है स्वर और लय ये दोनों समुद्र हैं इनमें से जितना जो ले सकता है तो बहुत थोड़ा बहुत मुझे अभी समझ आया है अभी मेरा पूरा जीवन समर्पित है कि मैं इसको पूरी तरह से इसकी गहराई ये है क्या सास सुर एक का करिश्मा क्या है ये भगवान ने पैदा किया है इसको हमारा जीवन समर्पित है इसको जानने का समझने के लिए और जितना जितना अच्छा अमान अन बजाते हैं तो मुझे अपनी एक अलग दुनिया क्रिएट करना पड़ती है और वो उसमें एक मुझे खुशी भी मिलती है और फिर मैं जो कुछ वो करते हैं फिर मैं उनके रास्ते में आना नहीं चाहता हूँ मैं अपना अलग रास्ता बनाऊँगा